What's up guys? So today I'm gonna talk to you about an art piece that I'm doing and it's super simple but I like the creative idea behind it and I'm gonna explain to you my whole thought process and I'm checking myself out because I got my fair beat up ripped up beetle shirt. I work in a studio garage with open door and it's really muggy and hot. This thing helps me a lot. It's a coconut plus mint cooling mineral mist from Little Barn Af Apple uh, Af of the car. I don't know how to pronounce that, but I'll put it there in the link below if you guys want to purchase it. This is a shit. So I did a time-lapse video of me painting. I didn't do a video of the background just because I forgot to do it, but I'm going to do another piece and I'm going to do it, but it's pretty simple. You'll see it. It has a rectangular block in the top, a square in the bottom, um, and a black outline. Um, which you guys could do at home. What I pretty much did for that is I taped it up so that I could have straight lines and that's how I kind of make my straight lines. It's never perfect, which, you know, to me, art is art and doesn't have to be perfect. So I like when it comes out like that so you can really tell that, that you know, it's something um, that was done by hand or organic or, or whatnot. So I haven't named this piece. Um, the idea behind it is I wanted to do the Monopoly playing cards. So Monopoly playing cards, as you know, you buy different properties. So obviously the best one is Boardwalk that everyone always wants. Well, that's the one I always want, the blue one, which I'll put a picture in this. And I was like, man, let me do something like that. But for like uh, Miami base, that's where I'm from. So I was like, let me start with South Beach. So I'm a big fan of the Miami Vice colors. Um, recently, the Miami Heat did their whole uniform and, and like, it's like, a I don't know what color the pink is. I want to say fuchsia. And then it's like a, a, a blue cotton color. And those two colors are super nice, which I have them here. So this is actually fuchsia, fuchsia and blue cotton. Um, I'm going to have all the materials linked in the, in, in the description so that if you do want to do this piece yourself, you could go ahead and, and watch this video and take any tips that I give you from it and make your own. Um, this piece that I also have is, is for sale. So if you do want to purchase it as well, you could go to my website, you could send me an email, you could write in a comment below, you could send me a DM on Instagram, whatever you want. So um, that being said, I kind of wanted to tell you the idea. So it's pretty much that. I want to do a piece that says South Beach on it. I want to do one that says Star Island on it. And then usually in the middle, there's a, another an, another piece and it has like an icon on it. So the one that I remember is, is um luxury tax, I, I believe, and it has like a diamond ring. I want to do like a yacht. That's very South Beach. You know, you got Star Island, South Beach, and a yacht. And that's it. And I think this piece would look super cool in, in someone's house, office, or or workspace, wherever, wherever you want to hang your art, um, the whole collection, so three pieces. As I was thinking about it, I'm like, man, this is a pretty cool, simple piece, has a lot of meaning behind it, very aesthetic, like pleasing, like it's nothing crazy and everyone gets it. And I was like, man, maybe I'll do one for Wynwood. Maybe I'll do one for Brickle. I'll do one for Hialeah. You know, I, I could have fun with it. I could do different cities. Um, so. I think it'll be fun. I don't, I don't think I've seen anything like it. The idea, I, I don't really remember how it came to me. I just, um, I think it was a canvas. I saw the canvas and I'm like, man, what fits perfect in here? And I just thought of that, you know? So obviously a lot of my art has to do with, with money. I like involving money in it. So Monopoly is a money game. And I went ahead and added that. So let me tell you guys a little bit about the, the material I use. So I told you about the paint. This is a Apple Barrel paint. Uh, you could get at Walmart, they're like 50 cents a piece. I went through two of each. One of the, um, two of the blue and one of the, actually two of the pink. This pink, when you, when you put it on a white canvas, you have to do two coats. So the more coats you do, the better. I also had black paint. Uh, I, I didn't bring it over here, but it's, it's black. I also like to use these acrylic markers. They're by Montana. They're called acrylic. There's different types of markers you could use, but these are my favorites. They come on um, <clears throat> a skinnier version. That's what I use to, to write the words. You can see in the video that I post, posted. Oh, regular paintbrush. I'm, I'm not, I don't get too fancy with the paintbrushes. Um, so I just get these, which I also have it linked below if you want to purchase a set. Um, you definitely want to have a rag to and water to, to clean it out, you know, and, and if you do work on a piece for more than a day, you know, make sure it doesn't dry up um, canvases. I use a big canvas. 
So you could get this at Michael's, you could order it online. I just got this piece, that I like big pieces, and this is kind of the size of the, the, the play card. If you get a smaller one, just make sure that, you know, the length is, is obviously longer. It has to look like a card. Like I said, I'm gonna put all the information in the link below, and that's pretty much it. I hope you guys like it. Share with your friends, hit subscribe, drop a comment, like if you wanna see more videos of this, and I'll see you guys later. Peace. I just finished putting South Beach on here and I wanted to tell people kind of what I was going through when I was uh, tracing that. So it's pretty soothing, relaxing to like take your time, do the words. I like to uh, chew, suck on a cigar um, when I'm painting. Helps me relax, I like it. I obviously listen to some music in the background. I'm not wearing my shirt because I'm in a studio garage. It's kind of hot in here. Um, this is a must, a fan. <laughs> Um, like I said, I'm going to put a list of all the things that I kind of use to um, create this piece of art. And I'll link it below in the description. And I'd like to see if you guys can make your own style. I think it'll be cool. Like a whole bunch of different Miami style Monopoly pieces or your hometown, your home city, whatever it is. Um, but yeah, check this out. So, so far I got South Beach. I got the price down there. I leave that pink, the cotton blue very simple piece what's gonna look cool about it is it's gonna have multiple pieces next to it like the actual game cards um and together it'll look like a nice set it's a pretty big canvas as you see i'll refine the words a little bit more um touch them up but all i gotta do is sign it with the number of days i've been alive and my signature i need to start another one similar to it which i'm gonna put star island on it and probably a different price on it and then i'm gonna have a middle card I, I kind of feeling the simplicity of this and, and doing a whole bunch of different styles like this. Maybe one of Wynwood with different colors, brick gold, like business type, building type. You know, I could do a Hialeah one, super funny one, like a 305 or there's a lot of things I could play with this. So I, I like this a lot. And that's the asking price that I'm asking for for these for now, for each one. If you're interested in it, you could DM me on Instagram. You could email me. You can find all that information in my description. Or you can check out my website. Hopefully it's updated. So excuse me if it's not. But let's finish this.